Hey guys, what's going on? It's Tanil, and welcome to my channel. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. That way you're notified every time I upload a new video. And for those of you who have been here before, welcome back. You guys, I am back today with another reaction video. And yes, I have another Shane Gillis clip. You guys know that I had posted a Shane Gillis video a couple of days ago and I was dying laughing at this guy because I had never seen him, never heard of him. And I was so glad <laughs> that I was introduced to him earlier this week because he had me cracking up. So you guys went crazy in the comments section below. Do Shane Gillis Special Olympics, Special Olympics. You guys were saying that was one of the funniest bits that he has. And then a lot of you guys flooded my email with a clip. So I have it and I'm very excited because like I said, this guy was freaking hilarious. So anyway, um, I have that uh, requested video. But before we jump into today's video, you guys know how to say thank you so much for all the love and support that you continue to show me across all of my platforms. Now, if you have not joined me on OnlyFans, Instagram, TikTok, Patreon, or Twitter, I just made a Twitter. You guys, all of that information is in the description box below. So all right, let's go ahead and jump into that Shane Gillis clip. My roommate, his girlfriend played college volleyball. So I'm very excited to like shit on volleyball whenever I can. <laughs> so I get in there and I was like, yo, volleyball is fucking, that's a weird culture. Get them fucking shorts, get them gym shorts. The shorts they're wearing is gross. And she was like, no, we need those shorts for speed okay. on the court. And I was like, uh, I, I know that's not true. I watched the NBA. <laughs> None of you are moving as fast as like a ref. Right. And those guys are wearing like slacks. <laughs> dress shoes for some reason. That's so true. Why? <laughs> she was like, no, we need those shorts. The tight shorts, they're essential. She compared them to like a helmet in football. Mm. I was like, I know they're not essential because I Googled the, uh, the Special Olympics volleyball team. <laughs> all, all of a sudden, those shorts weren't so essential for them. <laughs> What's that about? How baggy do you think they're? They looked like the fucking and one mixtape out there. <laughs> <laughs> Offensively baggy is how I would describe all of their attires. <laughs> We're all adults. We we can this. We all agree the Special Olympics is a good. It's a good program. I just. It's great. I just feel like the guy who came up with it had to be like a real risk taker. <laughs> You know what I mean? That's a wild thing to suggest for the first time. <laughs> Some guy in a board meeting, like, I got an idea. <laughs> we should be racing these motherfuckers. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> I was like, what'd you say? I'm like, fucking uh, town over said they had the fastest ones. You guys, what? So we settle it, you know? <laughs> I'm not making fun of the Olympians. The concept the is wild. <laughs> It's a while. Like, if your best right friend up. invented the Special Olympics and told you about it first, you'd be like, don't ever tell anybody. Right. That is so true. Who you... the fuck were you going to tell that to? What are you doing? It's like, what? I'm going to hell for laughing at this. <laughs> <laughs> you guys set me up for this one. I actually, so bad. personally, I actually volunteered and coached with the Special Olympics for a little while. So, you know, what'd you guys do? <laughs> What'd you guys do? No, don't clap. Please. <laughs> I did it for those kids. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> I look like this, so. Me coaching the Special Olympics, I was like a fucking double agent. <laughs> no one knew whose side I was on, dude. Player, chaperone, no one knew. I'd be standing there coaching, holding a clipboard with five dudes that looked exactly like me. Oh my God. You know, see the coaches from the other team looking over like, I think they got, I think they're fucking letting one of them coach. <laughs> you <laughs> like, guys, what? <laughs> so bad. Yeah. No, I did coach the Special Olympics for a little while and it's fun. That's another thing you're allowed to talk about. It's happy. Everyone there is sportsmanship. It's, it is funny. <laughs> Don't let anyone tell you it's not funny, dude. Oh my God, this there. is so bad. It, it, everyone there is laughing. It's fun. <laughs> I coach basketball. Kids would catch the ball, just fucking, <laughs> just fucking <laughs> launch it into the bleachers. 
People would be like, what the fuck are you doing out there? Like, I don't know. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> my whole team ruled. Everybody, every dude on my team, was the, they were the funniest. They fucking, they were bros. They were bros, dude. My whole team loved two things. They loved tits. <laughs> They do. I don't know if you know these guys. They fucking love the ladies. They love the ladies. And they love John Cena. John Cena? That's it. <laughs> that was the news every day. That's hilarious. We'd be in the huddle. They'd be like, there's a lot of ladies here tonight. I was like, ooh, yeah. They'd be like, what do you think John Cena's up to? <laughs> oh, you're going to have to get way worse before you meet him. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> See, it seems like the angel of death for those guys. I told, I told my guys, I was like, you see Cena coming, you get the fuck out of there. <laughs> <laughs> He's taking souls with him. <laughs> I love that he laughs at his own jokes. He's <laughs> Every year, Hooters would sponsor our one basketball tournament. <laughs> All right, so every year Hooters would bring like three or four waitresses and they would present like a big cardboard check donation to the Special Olympics. As soon as the girls entered the gym, the game changed <laughs> entirely, dude. It went from like hugs and sportsmanship to just like dudes got competitive, like very competitive. <laughs> Fucking ripping down rebounds. <laughs> just hitting layups. And <laughs> and then at the end of the game there'd be a hug line you know between the waitresses and the players and yeah that went about exactly exactly how you would imagine that one we had to break out the fucking jaws of life dude. oh my god my boys my boys are ragdoll in those young sluts <laughs> And I'm not knocking the, 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 the players. They were totally in the right. The girls were hot. The waitresses, like every year, I would sneak into the hug line myself. <laughs> no, he did not. Let's do that. All right, I think I'm going to get out of here, guys. Yeah. Thank you guys very much. A lot oh, my God. Okay, totally not exactly what I expected. Oh, but again, I think Shane Gillis is hilarious. And you guys... We're like, you gotta watch it, you gotta watch it. Now, I, in my defense, I'm gonna be just like Shane. In no way, shape, or form am I laughing at uh, special needs people or kids in the Special Olympics at all. He's a comedian, these are jokes. I hate that I even have to say this today, but no way, shape, or form am I making fun of them or laughing at them, laughing at messed up stuff that he was saying about the actual event. I think Special Olympics is very important for special needs kids. Um, I had someone uh, who was a, a child that I took care of who was special needs and who was in the Special Olympics and I just I and I went to the events and I thought it was very beautiful. So again in no way shape or form am I laughing at the kids or the people who are involved in Special Olympics. I'm just watching it. You guys set me up for that one. That was so bad. That was so bad. But it was definitely um it was hilarious. And I have so many different uh Shane Gillis clips in my inbox and I'm definitely going to get to several other ones uh sometime next week. All right, you guys, uh, let me know what you thought about today's video. Leave me your comments in the comment section below. And I know a lot of you guys have watched it already because you guys told me that I should watch it. Leave whatever you want in the, in the comment section. And if you enjoyed my reaction, please be sure to leave this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell, guys. And send me your clips, just to nail at gmail.com. Send me anything that you guys think that I would really enjoy to watch with you guys. Also, don't forget to follow me on all of my other platforms, you guys. All that information is in the description box below. All right, um, I love you guys. Y'all set me up, y'all set me up for that one. I love you guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye. God, cross my line for profit. Never that fly too high to be honest. Gold mine all of my blood. My whole mind harmonized with the cosmic. I get signs from the godzilla often. I cause the vibes so hard, keep caution. Never that faith in the path.